Hello and hi to everyone. Today we will discuss about two articles. First is uh, regarding Walmart, which uh, daily uses WeChat, and the second is uh, CAFA, which is called CAFA or China Animal Health and Food Safety. Now, the head of supply chain twin transition at DNV, Michel M, highlights that the Walmart has benefited from adopting WeChat blockchain. DNV is the through which uh, WeChain got partnership uh, with the Walmart, and it is a auditor uh, company, uh, big four. So WeChain has also benefited from the partnership as Walmart drives transaction volume to the network. So it is both are benefiting WeChain as well as Walmart. The WeChain blockchain's long-standing partnership with the American multinational retail corporation Walmart. continues making waves in the multi billion dollar food industry in china the chinese arm of walmart partnered with the wechain back in 2019 which means 3 4 years uh, partnership has been the partnership saw walmart build a blockchain based platform to enable customers to trace the origin of grocery item in its shop yes we all know through qr code and track and trace ability platform of wechain uh, items can be tracked to their origin according to a new article highlighted by the wechain uh, so um, walmart is using wechain's blockchain technology in china customers can scan products to view their origin and other information on the wechain powered blockchain platform the platform has benefited walmart and china it notes that the walmart customers use the platform daily they can scan products to get details of their origin and other information the article was written by michel the head of supply chain in the classification body dnv in the article michel maintained that wider blockchain adoption could potentially reduce cases of food borne illnesses globally because they are packaged and nobody knows how for how long they have been there so the diseases spread according to him food borne illnesses are still a major global issue as the world bank reported 600 million cases in 2022 so last year and there was 600 million use cases uh, 600 million cases of the disease food borne disease related to foods or grocery store blockchain technology deployment in the industry as as exemplified by the walmart can improve the speed and accuracy of food traceability protocols yes indeed it can improve the accuracy in the case of walmart the retail chain was able to provide the fda with the detailed information on the source of potential contamination within hours so you can see within hours the report can be sent the feat which was achieved back in 2020 was a significant improvement from the 7 days the process used to take so earlier it used to take a one week or 7 days now it uh, the it the process takes only few hours or one hour Uh, this is because of the speed of the blockchain the improvement was achieved with a reduced associated cost reduced losses and helped brands prevent damage to reputation yes because uh, reduced cost because uh, it is on blockchain and blockchain is uh, uh, very very less cost uh, causes um, and reduce losses because it can be transferred instantly so losses can be reduced at the earliest at the starting point and therefore the brands uh, keep their reputation intact walmart has also worked with the us customs and border protection to pilot a program to track imported goods so it is also working with the customs and border border protection walmart has uh, shown how food supply chain participant can easily arrange favorable processes due to the transparency of the blockchain technology Michel cites this as one reason Walmart has expanded its adoption of the blockchain technology beyond its Chinese operations. Uh, therefore, uh, this is a massive transaction, massive transaction volume on the WeChat because it is used daily by the Walmart employees. As evidenced by the on-chain metrics, the Walmart and WeChat partnership has benefited both parties. The amount of WeChain transaction originating from the Walmart customers rose all through 2022, which means last year, the transaction volume was uh, increasing the whole year, reaching a peak in the November. So two three months ago, it reached uh, the highest. According to a WeChain community, 
this massive transaction volume from Walmart is a solid revenue source for the network. Yes, we have covered about 7,000 transactions were processed within or 700,000 transactions were processed within 3 hours on the Walmart. Uh, the account also asserted that Walmart is only one of thousands of enterprises that will come on board with the VeChain, which means that Walmart is the starting point and there will be many more companies renowned companies that will come on the uh, VeChain platform, Toolchain, BAS, CSAS, etc. Uh, this will significantly boost real world use cases that VeChain is confident that it can handle in the long term. Yes, because it, if it can handle the Walmart uh, transaction volume, then it can uh, easily handle any of the company's transaction volume. Uh, this was the article this is saying that as per the recent report a popular blo blockchain based supply chain management platform VeChain has processed over 700,000 transactions within 3 hours for Walmart a multinational retail con uh, corporation uh, notably VeChain believes in the limitless application of the blockchain technology particularly in the world of supply chains Meanwhile, beyond the food industry, VeChain also aims to lead the green revolution through its real-world ready technology. Confirming the development, uh, yes, uh, uh, it added that VeChain with this development has achieved a real-world economically beneficial on-chain activity for Walmart with thousands to come. Notably, VeChain believes in the limitless application, yes, occasionally occasioned by the inefficiencies enveloped in the existing supply chain traceability system. The need for the exploration of blockchain become inevitable. Yes, it is, it is, it is going to be a must. Blockchain technology will be a must in the coming years in every field. Food and track, this is the grocery food and track tracing. It is can also be extended to the meat, 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 etc. Pran, chicken, beef, etc. Pork, etc. The technology, as reported, avails the most effective strategy to revamp the prevailing problems in the China. In the chain, it further helps in delivering new, unique capabilities for enterprise and consumers. So, second one is uh, 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 this is CFA China Animal Food uh, Safety. A recent journal article cites the VeChain blockchain as one example of blockchain platform disrupting the transforming sustainability supply chain tracking. VeChain v has made strides in powering blockchain based supply chain tracking solution to multiple industries. Recognition for VeChain continues to come in for its groundbreaking achievements in enabling sustainable supply chain processes. VeChain blockchain was highlighted in a recent journal published journal uh, article as an example of how blockchain technology can be deployed to transform and disrupt supply chain sustainability. VeChain's collaboration with the CAFA as the sole public blockchain technology provider in the alliance was highlighted in a recently published journal. CAFA or China Animal Health and Food Safety Alliance is a government backed organization directly under the Chinese National Agriculture Science Technology Innovation Alliance. The alliance was initiated by Ministry of Agriculture of the People's Republic of China. The alliance aims to build a trustworthy platform that connects the government, industry associations, producer enterprises and research institutes in the food sector. To achieve this, it focuses on increasing attention to food security, traceability and animal health to avoid recurring food related scandals from happening. CAFA which includes McDonald's in the China partnered with the VeChain as the sole public blockchain technology provider in 2022-2020. So it is a two-year partnership. The partnership saw the alliance build a VeChain blockchain-based farm-to-table food trust traceability platform that was launched in 2022. More than 130 CAFA members can all carry out traceability, testing and certification, precise recall and monitoring and early warnings activities in on the platform yes they can test uh, certify identify any weakness uh, and then monitor it uh, actively on time and quickly meanwhile the article also highlighted while uh, walmart's partnership um, 
with IBM to experiment with a similar blockchain based supply chain tracking no problem uh, mm, the partnership with CAFA is uh, let us know what is CAFA CAFA is under the Chinese National Agriculture Science Technology Innovation Alliance initiated by Ministry of Agriculture of the People's Republic of China. It is aimed to build an organization which has strong industry connections with the food industry. What will be the WeChain's role? As a council member on the CAFA, WeChain will be strategizing to develop a traceability system called Farm to Table for the cross-country track. The use of WeChain's toolchain will let council members lodge records of key processes and activities of the food network over blockchain. This will make the complete process secure, impenetrable and more trustworthy for the consumers and enterprises. This means traceability of a product will start from as early as, as, early as when it was being cultivated and continue further passing the phases of processing, packaging, logistic and even further to enterprises and finally in retail. CAFA who have always worked for giving consumers safe, healthy and quality food originated from the animal kingdom. WeChain's tool chain will be a big step towards it. This technology is already being implemented in the enterprise world. WeChain in a statement said that their traceability platform will allow CAFA and its alliance which means it's over 100 partners to use the WeChain Thor blockchain that will ac be accessible to the public without approaching WeChain individually. So you can say it, it is a compliance of 130 companies uh, and it is a developing a new platform uh, which now it is old which is called uh, farm to table or WeChain tool chain. We already know what is WeChain tool chain and this is a uh, about uh, its uh, two um, CFA and the Walmart uses which daily uses uh, WeChain. Therefore, its transaction is increasing day by day and in November it peaked with over 700,000 transactions in just three hours, not even single day or a week in just three hours. So we are saying slowly and slowly WeChain is progressing, building relationship and its partnerships are continuing. So partnerships are updating daily. Uh, so and they should be continuing and therefore it will uh, uh, increase the adoption of the VeChain worldwide and it will become a household names in uh, two or three years okay that's for today bye